Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You are watching Release with Shauna Elise. Insert title here. I can still do it. <laughs> I've been MIA. Um, I did record, I think, three videos um, earlier in June. Um, and they were actually kind of old videos because they stem from some, um, you know, information that I had from May. Um, you know, like when life hits you, it hits you. And my focus has been on my mental health and trying to do that and do this at the same time wasn't best for what I needed to do right now. So if you have stayed with my channel, which many of you have, I have grown in my subscriber base and I hit 1K in my Rainbow Try On Haul video, which I will link in the description box down below. I madly appreciate you because when things are going wrong in your life and you just feel like everything's falling apart and you get that notification from YouTube in your Gmail, that people are still watching your stuff, it's a little bit rewarding. It's a lot of bit rewarding. <laughs> so right now, um, I look bummy and it's not because I've been stressed out. I just got back from the gym and honestly, I recorded this video, um, not this video I'm doing right now, but the video I'm going to insert, which is about the title. Mm -hmm. um, I recorded this video, um, Sunday, be Saturday before last. Yeah, Saturday before last. Um, Charlotte Rose is trifling, y'all. They're so freaking trifling. I don't think that y'all even can begin to understand my frustration with them. Because be as far as discount clothing goes, Charlotte Rose was always my go-to. Like, I mean, back in the day... I used to go to Rainbow. That was my main go-to. But then on my 25th birthday, I mean, Charlotte Russo has been around for forever. But on my 25th birthday, Elisa Blue, shout out to Elisa Blue. She took me to Charlotte Russo to get my 25th birthday outfit. And after that, I was addicted to them because I was just addicted to them. And they played us. Y'all, they absolutely played us. You want to know how they played us? They're still freaking open. I go to the North Premium Outlet downtown in Las Vegas, and I'm walking with my mom. I just left Adidas. I bought myself two pairs of workout shoes, and we just walking around. And as I'm approaching Charlotte Ruse, I say, my store. And we hit the corner, and my mom says, Charlotte Ruse? And I'm like, why are they still open? So I walk inside, and I say to this cute little girl, I'm like, y'all play this. Y'all play this. And she's like, no, no, we got bought out by a company. So, you know, in the footage, in the video, which I will insert um, sometime during this video, I walked the store and got, you know, a few clips of what's going on in the store right now. Now, this is the outlet. I don't know um, what the other locations look like right now, but this is the outlet location that I was in. It was my favorite location. I couldn't walk in there. See, the way it's set up at the North Premium Outlets is Charlotte Russe is on the corner. Across from that is the Disney store and about two stores down is Children's Place. They got all my money on that corner right there. Like I could not go, I cannot go into that Children's Place without dropping a couple of hundred dollars. And then Charlotte Russe will get my money too. So between the two of those, it's devastation on a single mother, sorry. But I walked around and honestly, I am not impressed. Like I am not happy. I really feel like um, the merchandise that's in there is low quality. Um, I feel like if they were gonna buy them out, they should have kept the integrity of the brand. Now clearly for whatever reason, the brand went bankrupt. There was a reason why they got bought out. So maybe their price points for what they were selling was not, you know, profitable for them. My thing is, is that a true shopper would rather pay quality for something if you were going to increase the prices, keep the same quality, rather than bring in this 
I'm sorry. It's like Forever 21 bullshit to me. Like, nothing against Forever 21. Y'all know I shop at Rainbow and I do these try-on hauls for y'all. And, you know, Rainbow sometimes gives me freaking life. And they have some pieces that I'm like, okay, I love you. All right, what you doing? But then there's some pieces that I'm like, all right, I'll wear this once or twice. And I know it's going to mess up when I wash it. Charlotte Ruse, I know when I was buying something from them, it was something that I could keep in my closet for like a year or two. I never questioned me washing it and it messing up. But yeah, now they're a little bad chat. So I guess I'm gonna insert the video now of me inside the store. I'm assuming I would have already inserted the part of me walking up to the store. Maybe not, maybe so. I don't know. <laughs> but okay, yeah, watch the video. So yeah, I really didn't focus too much into like touching the stuff and really talking about the stuff. I will give y'all a try on haul. I will go shopping there this week. Um, let me take my butt down there on Friday. I'm going to surprise my daughter and take her on a date anyway. So let me take my butt down there Friday and I will let you guys know when I do my try on haul what's really popping. Um, with Charlotte Ruse, but I am completely devastated and I'm so mad I started my channel when I did as they were closing because honestly all these rainbow try on hauls I'm doing they would have all been Charlotte Ruse, but just with rainbow being down the street from my house it was a whole lot easier um, but yeah they're back but they're not back <laughs> I look dead my lips are all dry i missed you guys though thank you for tuning into my channel you are watching release with shauna Ru my name's not shauna release you are watching release with shauna elise make sure you hit that bell button so that way you are notified every time that i post a video subscribe if you're not subscribed yet and hit that like button so i can continue to try to grow my channel um, and you guys, I'm gonna I'm get back on it. My mental headspace is a lot better right now. Um, I'm feeling good. I'll talk to you guys about what's been going on. Um, if you guys want to know, I mean, um, I did post some things on my Facebook and I'm not a social media poster of things that are going on in my life that I am going through because I typically seclude myself when I'm going through something but you know I'm trying I'm still working with my trainer I'm still on this physical health journey as well as a mental health getting myself back to a great mental state because honestly you guys I before what's been going on has been happening over the last couple of years but it took a traumatic turn within the last seven months um, I honestly had been very happy, um, uh, my mental health. I feel like, you know, you have days where days just freaking suck. You have days when you're sad. You have days when you're going through something. But overall, I was very happy. Um, this did hit me pretty hard. 
and um, it wasn't no boy, it wasn't no man. <laughs> it had to do with a man, I guess you could say that, but it wasn't like relationship, I'm boohooing over a guy going through something. Um, it was it was over things that are going on with my child and um, me just being helpless and things being, I'm like looking at my hands, but things being out of my hands and for me not to be able to handle it the way I want to handle it, trying to go through the legal system and the legal system, y'all, is hard. It's hard because you want to protect your child at, you know, every, in any cost and um, when you're going through the legal system and things continue to happen, you have to, you know, stay within the legal system. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna leave it there. This video was about Charlotte Roos playing us. So thank you for watching. Uh, if you do wanna know, you know, I'm kind of in a good mood right now. I will film that video and if you guys do wanna see it, then I will post it. Just let me know in the comments down below. If you wanna know what I've been going through, I mean, I think anybody who has gone through divorce, child care, custody battle issues have gone through something similar. Mine just was something that my child, I feel like, is not safe where she is at. And there's really nothing I could do about it. And it kind of sucks. So, um, besides go through the legal system, that takes forever. And they do it on their time. But, yeah. So, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button down below. Make sure you guys check out my baby's YouTube channel. She also now has an Instagram. I am running it for her to keep all you perverts out of her uh her way mommy does run her instagram for her um, so she you will not be getting those special chats from a little seven-year-old um but i am trying to you know get her out there and start doing her things that she loves to do she's full of personality don't know where she gets that from don't know but she's full of personality she's full of size and she's just so amazing. And um, I'm just going to have her start documenting her life and her journey as she goes and doing the things that she loves. And I hope y'all get on her journey with her, okay? So if y'all subscribe to Mama, subscribe to Baby. If y'all subscribe to the Baby, subscribe to Mama. We both support each other. <laughs> and have a great day. Thank you so much.